sealing their reconciliation with a strategic energy deal. The Russian and Turkish presidents meeting in Istanbul have agreed on a project to build an undersea pipeline to get Russian gas to Turkey and then on to Europe. Ministers signed the Turk Stream Accord on the sidelines of the World Energy Congress. It's the latest sign of rapprochement since Ankara expressed regret for shooting down a Russian fighter plane over the Turkish-Syrian border last November. Despite deep differences on the Syrian conflict, the leaders were keen to show they're seeking common ground. President Erdogan saying he and his Russian counterpart had discussed cooperation, especially for the people of Aleppo, and what sort of strategy could be applied to bring peace to the area. While Turkey backs rebels fighting the Syrian regime, Russia is supporting President Assad with a massive air campaign. Nonetheless, we have a joint position when it comes to doing everything to deliver humanitarian aid to Aleppo, the Russian president said. The question is over the provision of security for delivering this aid to avoid provocations with the bombing of humanitarian convoys. Russia denies its warplanes were behind last month's deadly airstrike on an aid convoy near Aleppo.